And let's talk from sports medicine, our guy who's certainly been with us for over 25 years on the morning show at this time, Dr. Joe Congeni, Sports Medicine Center, Akron Children's Hospital. And Joe, some excitement when we go down the street here to Montrose when we talk about sports medicine. And, Joe, I'll kind of let you take the story from there, my friend. Yeah, I mean, you and I uh, were saying the other day we drive by it all the time, don't we? It's uh Exciting location, very, very exciting location for us. An exciting time for young athletes and and, uh, and those young kids and families that play sports. You know, we talk on this show, and you've given us such a great forum to talk about the kinds of injuries and unique uh, sports medical problems that young athletes have. And um, we really, at Akron Children's Hospital, we're just, you know, we're just so blessed, myself as a dad, to have uh, a children's hospital. It's one of the top children's hospitals in the country. I mean, the ratings just came out. You know, we are in the U.S. Uh, News and World uh, top children's hospitals in the country in many categories, and most notably uh, in our world is orthopedics and sports medicine. And so to kind of keep up with that, one of the things we really want to do is that we need a couple things um, for these unique injuries and problems that young athletes have. And number one is we need facilities for specialized care of young athletes. And we need a, a team of sports medicine and orthopedics and physical therapy and athletic trainers um, that are experienced in these kinds of injuries, number two. And number three, convenient hours for athletes. Athletes get hurt at certain times, uh, typically often at the end of the day or weekends. And we're addressing all of those with um, a brand-new urgent care center for sports medicine uh, in, in Montrose. It's right at uh, 77 and um, 18. Uh, it's, it's very, very exciting for us. We've had this concept elsewhere, and, you know, you're in the strategic world. Hey, what would be an important place where there's a lot of athletes? Well, that is really the epicenter, the center of where there's a lot of athletes and a lot of kids and families playing youth sports, and so we are really excited this weekend on Saturday to have the open house for people who've been driving by it. Gosh, I can't tell you how many times I've answered for people. Um, hey, gosh, when's that place going to open? What's it look like inside? Well, you get your chance to see it on Saturday morning. We're going to have a trick-or-treat for the young kids. We're going to have uh, 10 to noon. We're going to have people get a chance to see this beautiful facility in Montrose. Uh, right again at 77 and 18, um, where the old golf galaxy used to be. And, and what we're going to be able to um, address there uh, from the standpoint of the hours, 9 a.m. to 8 p.m. Uh, during the week and Saturday hours so that uh, these young athletes that are injured can be seen. Uh, we have a team of experienced pediatric sports medicine people. So, you know, a lot of times when you go to just a general urgent care or other places, you're going to have people that are not used to seeing these um, unique and specialized injuries, and they're not going to have some of the specialized equipment needed for that. And, and we are going to be able to have those things in the Sports Medicine Urgent Care Center that is at 77 and 18. And I want to also let you know that there has been the corridor as you go down 18 to Pinnacle Sports. For a couple of years now, several years now, we've had one of the really nicest uh, – physical therapy areas, rehab areas, right inside Pinnacle Sports, where we have two of the most experienced um, uh, PTs that both uh, 10 to 15 years in the field, Amy Cray and, and Matt Perkins, seeing people for physical therapy down there at those new, beautiful facility. And so right down the road from this uh, sports medicine urgent care, people can get their physical therapy. There's, I think, 12 travel teams in Pinnacle and so it's a great location for that. And then finally, the third and final is we had a, a really great open house for the Medina Health Center, a little further down 18, uh, closer as you move closer towards downtown Medina. We have just built out a, a brand new a building out. It's going to be opening up in the next couple of months is a um, medical health facility. It has 18 different specialties in it, but in our area that we're so excited about, Every day of the week, we will have physical. Ther we will have uh, uh, sports medicine and orthopedics, and two really experienced people. Dr. Julie Kerr uh, is there. She's over 20 years. Uh, Dr. Mark Adamchek, over 20 years in pediatric orthopedics 
and Julie in pediatric sports medicine at the Medina Health Facility. So we really have that area covered along 18 and particularly excited about the Sports Medicine Urgent Care Center um, with an open house Saturday for people to get a look at it and get a thought of where it's at, how they could access it, and where this specialized equipment is, and some of the really experienced people. One of our great young uh, uh, pediatric sports medicine doctors, Dr. Brian Riley, is uniquely trained in urgent care. So not just the uh, acute care of injuries, but also urgent care things uh, that need to be seen urgently. And so with those extended hours, with those specialists in those areas, we're very excited about this region of the country, which is very near where I live. Uh, we're going to be ready to deal with just about any sports-related problem uh, for your young people. And so we really encourage people, get out and take a look at this place. Uh, the Urgent Care Center is opening very soon in the next couple of weeks. And we have the open house again on Saturday. Uh, and, Joe, you're exactly right with the location there. And, you know, you got basketball on the horizon. You still have soccer going on and football and travel baseball, all this stuff here. Those injuries do occur in the late afternoons, early evenings. It's going to be nice to have that available. What type of service is available in there, just so the, the folks listening understand if there is an injury on the field, on the court or something, is that a place they can go to readily? Oh, for sure. I mean, so uh, so close, like you said, and convenient. And then um, urgent care, getting people moving right away, seeing them till 8 o'clock, you know, five days a week and Saturdays also. And so we have uh, we uh, a lot of our athletic trainers work with the high schools and work through that uh, uh, center as well. And we have all of the equipment necessary to evaluate kids, just like we do in our downtown office nice. uh, in our new University of Akron facility. Uh, we now are going to be able to bring that to Montrose and West Akron. And, gosh, so many schools close to that. We have you know, Highland, Copley, Wadsworth, are schools that we help take care of, Norton, Revere, uh, all in that area, Firestone uh, on the west side. And people are going to be able to get convenient hours and get these facilities, same facilities that we have downtown and have, have um, offered to people for so many years, uh, right now in their backyard. Uh, and so full evaluation services with x-rays and, uh, and all the equipment that we need to uh, evaluate and, and diagnose these kids and get them going on their treatment. And we work closely and communicate then with the physical therapy, which is right down the road at Pinnacle, in getting them going uh, for rehabilitation and get them back on the field. All right, Joe, great stuff. And, again, that open house time for you this was Saturday is? Yep, 10 to noon all on right. Saturday. All right. Sounds good, Joe. Thank you for the time to visit, my friend. Always appreciate it. Thanks, Ray. Have a great rest of the week. You too. Dr. Joe Congeni, Sports Medicine Center, Akron Children's Hospital with us.